Hi, this is another tutorial. This is a side training tutorial on how to side chain in Cubase 4 or 5. What I'm going to do is show you a quick track that I've worked, done that demonstrates side chaining. Um, basically, it's a kick or another sounder that triggers a compressor on another bus um, and it compresses another sound altogether. Gives it that good bouncy ducking motion. Anyway, here's an example of it. So as you can hear, it's the ducking going on there. It gives it that bouncy sort of sound. That's very popular in dance music at the moment. How to do it? I've got a kick. And I've got some pads. And as you can hear, they don't duck at the moment. They're not bouncing. The strings are very sustained. How do I make them duck? Easy. Add a group channel. There's my group channel, it's now added. I can call this sidechain. I can call it whatever I want, but I'll call it sidechain. If I bring my mixer over, what I'm going to do is I'm going to assign my pad from stereo output to group sidechain and also the virus. I'm going to send that to the sidechain. On the sidechain bus, what I'm going to do is I'm going to insert a compressor. So the standard Windows, not standard Windows, standard Steinberg Dynamics Compressor and that is inserted on the stereo group track that I've assigned the pads to. What I'm going to do is I'm going to activate sidechain, just adjust this down initially, whack that up. The reason why I've done that is just so I can actually hear it straight away and then I can adjust it at a later time. Okay, so now we've got a compressor on the pads and as you can yeah, nothing's happening. What I'm going to do on my kick now, which is this channel here, if I solo, on the sends, if I click on the blank space and there's a group sidechain um, or I can actually send it to the sidechain, don't send it to the group sidechain because the kick will set, go to the group as well, chord sidechain. Send it to the actual sidechain itself and turn the send up. And then again then you can alter that how much ever you want. And now as you can see the kick Is triggering the side chain. And you can just add, add more and more. And that's it, it's really easy. And that's pretty much exactly what I've done on this track here. And the amount of sends and groups and side chains you can have is as many as you want really you got eight cents per track and you can have as unlimited tracks i think it's up to a thousand tracks not that you'd ever go that far but there you go side chaining very easy so we've sent the pads to the group channel and this group channel is called I don't know, let's call it group one as you can see and it's not sent to group one it's sent to the side chain and as you can see i've turned it all the way up and now brilliant easy easy peasy Anyway, that's the end of the tutorial.